Sensation, one of the best players in the whole world. DiCaprio is the character who he's been maining over the past few months, and he's really made her work. Former yep. EVO champion. He actually, I, I heard him say that at one point in time, he actually admitted that if he had saved DiCaprio and never showed that he played this character until this EVO, he might have actually had a really good chance of taking EVO by hiding his character. There is something to be said for that. I did see, talk to Infiltration early in the tournament, and I said, do you think you're going to win? And you know what he said to me? He was like, uh, I don't know. And I looked at him and was like, you're supposed to say yes. And he was like, 69% chance. <laughs> okay, there you go. 69, dudes. <laughs> oh, good block, but no punish from Geronimo. Geronimo from US, not specifying where in the US. <laughs> yeah. Wow, did right he now, do that medium well. up? Looked like he did that stomp medium enough that it wasn't puni as punishable. Yeah, you can do that. Okay. Yep, yep. And that's a lot of confidence from Infiltration to end it like that, and rightfully so. Interesting to see Geronimo go with uh, Kami, yet he's wearing that Mecha Zangu shirt. Ooh, traitor. <laughs> It's really cool. I didn't know Kaneda made a Mecha Zangief shirt. I, know, I have the Zangief one. It's been hard for Geronimo's Kami to really nail down where DiCaprio is going to be. Even there when he thought he had the right approach. Yeah. The infiltration landed and had the uppercut ready, you know? Yep. I mean, that's kind of what DiCaprio's game really is. It's just, you know, misdirection. Where am I? Where am I? Yeah. They actually really did make a very interesting character out Agreed. of DiCaprio. Agreed. Yep, not much you can do in that situation. Only thing that Kami has that might have been able to avoid that was an EX Pin Knuckle, which would have been a great move because it would have went through the Psycho Sting, hit her, and then he would have been able to combo into Ultra mid-screen. Oh yeah, that works. I haven't seen that for like five years. Dude, who lands that move? Yeah, exactly. Who lands that move? Well, that is that. Infiltration with a couple of rounds that were perfect, and he skates by in that pool, which was, again, pool D22. So pool D23, we saw Pi Smug. That was the first round. Mm -hmm. Saw him win. Pool D24, Ponza Man, a Rolento player from Japan, and Lazy One, a jury player from New York. Pool D25 has Fubar Duck, Ibuki from Texas, and uh, yep. many other games as well. Uh, LLL, RSD, MBR, an Akuma player from the Netherlands, one of the strongest out there. Yeah, yeah Very yeah. good player. Fruit, who I was very impressed by, a Sakura player from Dubai. We saw him when uh, some of you know some American and, and Korean players went out to the UAE and they That's and they right. played. Yeah. And I thought he was really good. I was really impressed I'm by his Sakura player. I'm glad to see him here then. Yeah. So yeah, I'm sure a lot of people will have a great chance to catch him on stream. Yeah, as that'll well. be cool. Uh, Filipino champ is also in D26. Mm -hmm. D28 has Ryan Hart. Sagat player, it's, well, not just Sagat, actually. He has quite a few characters up yeah, his sleeve yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. from the UK. And very, that's very, it for Pools D. Yeah, Ryan Hart, of course, very strong Capcom player. So, yes. yes, Capcom player Ryan Hart. Yep, Capcom player Ryan Hart, you know. Yeah, well, he Evo, has played. Former Evo champion. In, in, in what? In, in Tekken. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> All right, well, who we have next? It is Mad Jester from Fargo, North Dakota, Evil Ryu. And his opponent will be Willie from Taiwan. Oh, the Hakan player. Ooh, okay, okay, okay. okay. So is he joking?